This kind of war is a noteworthy book that delves into the Korean War and its significance in history. In this video, we will discuss seven valuable lessons that can be learned from this book. 1. The Importance of Strategic Planning Strategic planning is crucial in ensuring the success of military operations, as seen in the book This Kind of War. It involves setting clear objectives and developing a comprehensive plan of action, taking into account various factors such as enemy capabilities and terrain. Without strategic planning, military forces can be caught off guard, leading to unnecessary casualties and setbacks. In the book, the importance of strategic planning is highlighted through the experiences of the U.S. forces in the Korean War. It shows how effective planning can help in achieving military objectives, while also adapting to changing circumstances on the battlefield. Strategic planning allows for the allocation of resources, manpower, and equipment in a way that maximizes the chances of success. It also involves contingency planning to address unforeseen events and adapt to enemy tactics. The lessons learned from the Korean War underscore the value of strategic planning in overcoming challenges and achieving victory. 2. The Impact of Political Decision-Making The impact of political decision-making in this kind of war is a central theme throughout the book. It highlights how the decisions made by political leaders can have far-reaching consequences on military operations. The author, Thierry Fehrenbach, emphasizes the importance of understanding the political context in which wars are fought. Political decisions can shape military strategy and tactics, often determining the outcome of battles. The book illustrates how political considerations, such as domestic approval ratings or international alliances, can influence military planning. It also explores the challenges that arise when military commanders must balance strategic objectives with political constraints. By examining political decision-making, readers gain a deeper understanding of the complexities of war. The lessons from the book serve as a reminder of the interconnectedness between politics and warfare. Ultimately, this kind of war underscores the profound impact that political leaders can have on the course of conflicts. 3. The Role of Military Leadership The lesson of the role of military leadership in this kind of war highlights the crucial importance of strong and effective leadership in the military. Military leaders must possess a combination of strategic thinking, tactical skills, and the ability to inspire and motivate their troops. They are responsible for making difficult decisions under pressure and guiding their soldiers through challenging situations. Effective military leaders also prioritize the well-being and morale of their troops, ensuring that they are well-trained, well-equipped, and well-supported. They must lead by example and set a high standard of discipline and professionalism for their subordinates. Additionally, military leaders must be adaptable and flexible, able to adjust their tactics and strategies in response to changing circumstances on the battlefield. They must also be able to communicate clearly and effectively with their superiors, their subordinates, and other allied forces. Ultimately, the success or failure of a military operation often hinges on the leadership qualities of the commanding officer. Good leadership can inspire courage, loyalty, and resilience in the face of adversity, while poor leadership can lead to confusion, disorganization, and ultimately defeat. 4. The Effects of War on Civilians War in all its devastating impact takes a heavy toll on civilians. Innocent men, women, and children often bear the brunt of conflict. Their lives are disrupted, homes destroyed, and families torn apart. The physical and psychological scars of war can last for generations. Basic necessities such as food, water, and shelter become scarce in war-torn areas. Civilians are forced to flee their homes in search of safety, becoming refugees in their own country or seeking asylum in neighboring nations. Children are robbed of their childhood, forced to grow up in a world filled with violence and fear. Women are particularly vulnerable during times of war, 
often becoming targets of sexual violence and exploitation. The effects of war on civilians are far-reaching and long-lasting, impacting not only the current generation but future ones as well. It is essential to remember the human cost of war and strive for peaceful solutions to conflicts. 5. The Significance of International Relations Understanding the significance of international relations is crucial in the context of this kind of war. It highlights the importance of diplomacy and cooperation between nations in times of conflict. International relations serve as a framework for managing global issues and maintaining peace and stability. The book demonstrates how international alliances can shape the outcome of wars and influence geopolitical dynamics. It emphasizes the impact of cross-border relationships on military strategy and decision-making. The lessons learned from international relations in the book offer insights into the complexities of warfare in a globalized world. By exploring the nuances of international politics, readers gain a deeper understanding of the interconnectedness of nations. The significance of international relations in the book underscores the role of power dynamics in negotiations between countries. It sheds light on the challenges and opportunities that arise from navigating the complexities of international diplomacy. Overall, the lesson highlights the critical role of international relations in shaping the course of conflicts and shaping the future of nations. 6. The Challenges of Military Technology The lesson of the challenges of military technology in this kind of war highlights the evolving landscape of warfare, particularly in the context of technological advancements. It delves into the impact of new weaponry on both offensive and defensive strategies, showcasing the need for adaptation and innovation in the face of changing military capabilities. The lesson also emphasizes the importance of staying ahead of the curve when it comes to military technology, as falling behind can have devastating consequences on the battlefield. It sheds light on the complexities of modern warfare and the challenges that come with navigating a rapidly evolving arms race. Furthermore, the lesson explores the ethical considerations that arise with the development and deployment of advanced military technologies. It serves as a reminder of the constant need for vigilance and preparedness in the realm of national defense. The lesson also underscores the significance of strategic planning and foresight in utilizing military technology effectively for achieving military objectives. It prompts readers to consider the implications of technological advancements on the nature of conflict and the ways in which nations approach defense and security. 7. The Legacy of the Korean War the legacy of the Korean War in the book This Kind of War highlights the lasting impact of the war on both Korea and the United States. It emphasizes the importance of understanding the complexities of war and its aftermath. The lesson discusses the human cost of conflict, including the deaths and injuries suffered by soldiers and civilians. It also delves into the political implications of the Korean War such as the division of Korea and the ongoing tension between North and South Korea. The lesson underscores the need for diplomacy and peaceful resolution of conflicts to prevent future wars. It sheds light on the sacrifices made by those who fought in the Korean War and the lessons that can be learned from their experiences. The lesson serves as a reminder of the importance of remembering and honoring the veterans of the Korean War. It encourages readers to reflect on the impact of war on individuals and societies. The legacy of the Korean War serves as a cautionary tale about the consequences of failing to resolve conflicts peacefully. It calls on readers to strive for peace and reconciliation in the face of adversity. Thank you so much for joining me today on this journey through the pages of this kind of war. I hope you found the lessons and insights on the book both engaging and informative. If you enjoyed the content and found it valuable, please hit the like button and subscribe to the channel for more in-depth book lessons and insights. Until our next literary escapade, happy reading, and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Take care and stay inspired.